Hey, we're at a special preview event with Samsung. I'm standing here with Joe Stiziano, the executive vice president at Samsung. Joe, uh, got quite a spread going on here. I'm seeing flat and curved Ultra HD TVs. There's something monstrous next door, and I hear there's a, a curved version somewhere as well. Why don't you tell me about what you guys did this year? Sure, so first of all, 2013 was when the year we launched UHD. It was a great year. We ended the year as number one in UHD TV. And now in 2014, taking that, of course, to new heights as only Samsung can. So this year, our focus is on curved UHD. So if you think about UHD in general, it's more pixels, higher pixel density. So when you get those large TVs, it becomes very important. But also now when you take this curved idea and make a much more immersive experience out of the whole TV uh, experience, yeah, obviously curved is a little more expensive to make. So uh, we're giving consumers choice as always. And uh, the market's going to explode. You know, By 2017, we expect the UHD market to be 60 million pieces worldwide. So it's going to be a real marketplace. So you're going to have models up and down the entire lineup of the UHD. I understand there's also a bendable display here. Tell me about that. So this is some real cool stuff. So this is a proof of concept, but what you'll see next door is a TV that actually starts out as flat. We press the remote control and it bends out and confirms to uh, whatever curve you like, what do you find more appealing? So, uh, you know, most people prefer curved. We did consumer research, about 80% prefer curved. But it's about giving choice to consumers. And if you want to display some still art or something on the wall, maybe you don't like curved. But imagine in the future if you, this TV's off center in a different part of your room and you can adjust the curve to a viewing position. It just opens up a lot of opportunities for consumers. How did you do that? I mean, is that an OLED panel or is that an LCD panel that moves? How, how did you accomplish the, the bendy? Uh, no, it's a basic LCD panel, but it's obviously, it's not a glass panel. Uh, we've got some proprietary technology that allows us to bend that uh, to about 4200 radii, which I learned this week is the optimal radius for a distance that we sit at home about 12 to 15 feet away. Interesting. So I also noticed that your uh, some of your curved displays this year are indeed wall mountable. As far as I know, you're the only player in the industry to make that happen. Uh, how much of a priority was it for you to make a curved display that you could mount on the wall? Uh, as far as I know, we are the only one. But for me, when I saw UHD on the wall, was when I got even more excited about it. When you see that on a wall and you see it, you sit down on a couch and you're able to lose everything else that's around it, but just really focus on the content, um, it just absolutely was the uh, icing on the cake for us. All right, and finally, uh, the monster next door to us has 105 inch curved LED TV, 4K Ultra HD yeah. in a cinema wide aspect ratio. Can you talk a little bit about what makes this TV different? So that's not something that's gonna be in everyone's home this year, we understand. But the idea of curved and being immersed in it obviously got us to thinking about what if we went 21 by 9 and how would that look? Um, and I think you could see that not much could compete with the Vegas Strip and the fountains going on out there, but that TV competes even with the scenery back on the Vegas Strip. So it's a proof of concept. It's demonstrating what this could look like in a 21 by 9 format. You know, it's definitely a luxury device to be certain. Um, so much so that uh, it looks like you guys put wood paneling on the back of that. Is that what, tell me, tell me more about that. Uh, it's, again, a proof of concept, but uh, we thought if we were going to make something beautiful to put a piece of actual real curved wood on the back of that, uh, you know, from, from all the right forests and all that good stuff, uh, it just adds an element of elegance to the, the design. That's awesome. Well, Joe, thanks for talking to Digital Trends today, and uh, you guys have a real strong showing. Thanks for having us.